In this video, we will look at web agent configuration and registration. We have done with web agent installation. So we will do configuration and registration. Okay, yeah, if we go into the web agent folder. We have done with the installation. Now we will do with configuration. So we are going to configure against Apache running on this box. We will do registration later. Next. And yeah. agent config object is this one, ACO. So we need to create, we need to give it over there. Okay, we install we now configured web agent. So, so the web agent is configured against Apache, the web server. I'll go and see. Okay, so now after configuration, this file is generated here. So I'll make it no for now. So when, when we first time install the software, we get a sample file. And when we configure file, now we get a webagent.conf. Now when we register a uh, web agent, then we will get another file, SM host. So I will do the registration from command line, my preferred method. You could have done from the GUI, but uh, I prefer doing from here. So yeah, I do like this. Okay. Local host, I find you username, SiteMinder hyphen p password and then host host name local host and host configuration object sm hco so the host configuration object is it is here this one this one so we create the configuration object Right, this is basically the address of our policy store. So we are telling this web this web agent to go and talk to the go and talk to this 
policy server. So we are enabling a secret key between web agent and policy store. Yeah, so yes, this is now written. Host registration written to smos.conf. So it is written in this location, bin file, bin location. I'll move from here to the configuration where it is looking. Okay, I need to give the path here. So what I will do is I'll move the file from bin and I'll put it in a proper uh, conf folder so that it is easy for us to maintain. No, not here. So it is in SiteMinder bin, the location from where we executed that. Yeah, this is a file as some host. I move it from here. And go to web and paste place it here. The conf, right? So I need to pass this uh, SM host uh, location in the webagent.conf, right? So what I do is I'll open another program files Apache Apache con This is web .conf if I open here. So I'll give the host config file. The host config file is here. And the file name. So we are telling this web agent to talk to this configuration file and this configuration will talk to the policy server. Right, I did not yet enable date. Right, I still make it no. I just made the conf configurations available because uh, we don't have the policy created for uh, this application and local host. Okay, so I'll stop here and uh, we will discuss about the system objects in another video.